welcome back to the channel and welcome to the channel if you're just coming across this video today. So if you are, my name is Chloe and I do a lot of vlogs on here, lifestyle videos, fashion hauls, styling, home decor, all of that jazz so you can catch up on that but as you can see from the title of this video I have been doing some shopping recently so if you missed my last vlog I will leave it on the screen I never know which way and also down below because it will kind of make sense moving on to this video as I went shopping recently and I wanted to treat myself so whenever I look to treat myself to a luxury purchase it is normally something that has kind of been on my wish list for a while and also something that I've definitely done my research into so I I went earlier this week to the Celine store on New Bond Street and before I even go any further this store has just recently been renovated and it is chef's kiss the interiors in this store are just next level I literally just want to copy and paste them into my future home so nice in the store I've been in a few times now because I've been looking at the triumph bag I'll put a picture on the screen of the one that I've got my eye on it's the cream lizard one now with the lizard bags obviously this leather is a lot more expensive compared to the calf skin ones so kind of um and in which to go for and I've also recently seen that Farfetch also stock Celine products on their website. It is kind of hit and miss with what they have available with like new season and they also do pre-owned so if you are looking to shop on a Farfetch I do have a discount code at the minute. This is not sponsored, this is not an ad, just generally if you do like shopping for luxury items we'll get you some money off and it's 10% so I'll leave the discount code on the screen and also down below because like I said it is valid on Selena but I did go into store like I said for these purchases so I've made two different purchases if you watch the vlog you will have actually heard what I said I did buy but I wanted to do a separate video to unbox because I was literally by the way I feel like I might have something in my teeth I've just eaten my lunch I really hope not because I've just filmed this first half of the video but like I was saying, I was rushing back after I made this purchase the other day and I didn't really have time to properly unbox it. So I thought I'll do a bit of a sit down video, talk you through it, the price points and also the experience that I had in Celine because this is actually the first time I've brought from Celine in store. And I have to say the experience was so good the assistant came over to us straight away she obviously saw that I was looking at the bag she was telling me loads of details about it and just really wasn't pushy at all and then I just said to her like I want to have a little bit of a look around and I'm also coming in here for the belt so she's like no worries let me go get you a few sizes of the belt because we were on an RNF to go for the 75 or the 80. So me and my friend Chloe were shopping around and she was just super chill because I feel like sometimes in these stores they can be kind of like following you, watching you and it just personally for me it puts me off. So I'm first going to show you the first box which is the bout. So I went for the Triumph bout and like I said I was not sure which size so I'm really glad I went in and tried it and I ended up going with the size 75. Now this bout I've definitely been eyeing up for a while now. It is just so chic so classy i love it and it's just so minimal as well but i like the fact this one is the thinner one because it like i said it goes great with like tailored trousers in the belt loops and i also wanted to wear this around like blazers not so much coats especially hopefully now we will start transitioning into the warmer weather but i also wear a lot of gold jewelry so the gold hardware on the belt is beautiful as well with obviously the Celine logo. I honestly feel like this just makes an outfit. Like I would just wear a t-shirt, tailored trousers, this belt and you're good to go. And then obviously you can accessorize it with a jacket and your bag. But I'm really glad I got this. So it's 365. This was the black one as you can see and this was the size 75. So I have zero zero regrets about this so that was my first purchase and that's kind of what I went in for and I also wanted to have a look at the bags but the bag I actually also was interested in they didn't have in stock hence why I didn't get the bag but this other purchase which is in this bigger box here is also something I've been looking at so I do have some trainers in my wardrobe. I have like my Comme de Garcons and I have my Chanel trainers, which I wear so much to the point I'm now getting worried that I'm kind of dirty in them and I'm wearing them too often. So these have been on my radar and I feel like they're kind of a little bit different for me, but at the same time, very me, if that makes sense. So I was looking at getting the Nike Dunks, but I just had my eye and my heart set on these and I'm really glad I went in and actually tried them 
because I was kind of on and on if to actually go for the high tops, the mid or the low. And when I saw these ones, which are in here, I'll show you how they package it up, which is really nice. You also get the dust bags. So I went with the mid tops and I just love them. So these actually have the Velcro detail here, whereas the other ones don't. There's actually two different styles that I saw in store. So the high tops didn't have this. The sales assistant was actually talking me through these trainers. So they actually came out, I think it was around last spring, summertime, but there was a delay in the stock. So a lot of people were trying to get them and it was hard to get them. So when they finally came, they were basically like the spring summer trainer. And then now this year, they're gonna be bringing them out. If you can see here, they've got like detailing that wraps around in different colors, like yellow, orange. This is what the sales assistant also informed me on. So for me, I just wanted the plain white. Very me, I know I'll be able to match it with a lot in my wardrobe because there was another style that had black here, which again, were beautiful, but I just like how understated these are. So they've got the Celine logo at the back here, the Celine logo here on the tongue of the shoe, and then just slightly on the Velcro part. But these kind of look similar to the Night Dunks, like the shape of them. But oh my God, when I put my foot in this trainer, it was so comfortable. It literally feels like you're walking on a cloud. Like there's so much cushioning inside of here. These are literally brand new out of the box. I haven't yet worn them out, but you can see they've obviously just got a lot of padding around here as well. So I know they're just gonna be so comfortable and I'm really excited to start styling these up. I just love them. I just think they're so understated, so minimal but you know that they're the Celine trainers. So happy with them. The purchase price for these were 590 pound. And like I said, I think it was worth it in my eyes because I know I'll wear these a lot. It's just a classic trainer that you can literally wear every day. I also went true to size with these. These are a UK five, which is EU 38. And I was quite worried because when I did ask her for these trainers, she was like, we've only got a certain amount of sizes left. So I was lucky that they had them on the day. Just the overall experience in store was so nice. And she actually, I forgot to say, so once we had picked what I wanted, she was just like, because we were rushing out to go to an event. She was like, no, stay, like, let me get you both a glass of champagne, go and sit at the back. There was like this beautiful area where we could sit. Again, the interiors were amazing. And she was just like, chill, no worries, like take as long as you want. It just felt really nice at ease experience. And as we were walking out, she had these little bags for me, my friend Chloe, and she just gave us some little samples of some of the perfume because the little perfume area in there is so beautiful. So these are the little ones and these will fit actually really nice in a handbag. So I was really happy, I was really happy with the purchases. I will try and link them down below for you guys. And if you do wanna see how I'm gonna be styling these pieces up, you can go and follow me over on my Instagram if you're not already, and I'm sure you'll be seeing it over there very soon. So I wanted to keep this video short and sweet, just show you the unboxing of the items, obviously following on from my last vlog, and hopefully you enjoyed it. If you do like these kind of luxury unboxing videos, please do give me a like, and make sure to hit subscribe so you don't miss the upcoming videos, and turn the bell notification on and I will see you guys in the next one.